Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to handle frames. Frames we can able to add by using by index position or by value. Right, any one we can able to use by and we can able to use the name of that frame that also we can able to use and we can able to provide and we can able to use for uh, X path and all we can able to create for that particular frame and that also we can able to test it and basically what I can say I'll show you our main intention to achieve for that frames see now there are a couple of frames are present. How to identify whether it is frame it is presented in that particular web page or not means first any place you can able to right click. Then you can able to see there is a view frame source or reload frame. Any one of them if you see then it is having frame in that particular web page. How to identify another way of thinking means you can able to Control F here, not here. You can able to page source. In case we are not able to see, but still it, the, there is a frame it is presented. Then you can able to click view page source and Control F I frame. If you click this one, and you can able to find the frame wherever it is presented. In our case, there are seven locations it is frames are presented, but our main is three frames only because starting ending points also it is find out. And you can able to see there are three couple of frames are presented. One is package list frame and package frame and class frame. These are three different kind of frames are presented with the name of that. Okay. We can able to use for the name of path for that particular frame to identify. Even you can able to give the index position. 1, 2, 3 like that. But if you have already path, x path, uh, any name value or id value or something, locators, then you can able to use that is the best way to identify your frame is the best. Okay. And now our main intention is like I'm going to click here and again I'm clicking here and again something some index if I'm click that index see now it is presented something new value whether those values are presented or not we are going to just we are going to click and see that that particular frame we are able to switching one frame to another frame okay now settings and libraries selenium libraries then I'm going to use test case frame test case and open browser this is basically opening for that URL purpose I'm going to use this URL and Chrome okay and maximize the browser and I'm going to use for some sleep three seconds because the page need to be load right now our main intention is to switching the frame correct switching the frame if I click the view source page we found already the frame x path value right I'm going to find the frame the frame name is here correct now again we are going to click going to here select frame you can able to see there is a method select frame and locator and I'm going to use for name and 
I'm going to provide for our value. Now I moved even you can able to use ID and export and all also. No issues. Okay. Now I need to click any one link. Click link. I'm going to provide the click link. I'm going to use this your this particular value. Okay, now after clicking, I need to click for second frame. I need to jump, I need to move out of this frame, right? Because if you are staying there and if you are going to click another framework, it is not possible. If you done something operation in the first frame, you have to jump out of the frame, then only can able to move second frame. Otherwise, it will not possible. Then for that, unselect is a unselect frame it is not required any path and all it is just unselected means it is jumping for out of the frame then again i'm going to use select frame and again we have another frame that is called package frames uh, name and I, I come here and again click link and I need to use I need to use to click for first one BID okay now I'm going to use this name of the locator the value okay now again I need to unselect the frame and this selection and unselection, I need to wait at least two seconds of time. Okay. Then again, sleep two seconds. Then I need to come to this particular location. Okay. In this particular location, any one of the index or something which is clicking no frames like that, if it is presented or not, if frames okay now you can able to see inspecting this particular page whether this particular one i need to without frame place i have to mode then it is a anchor tag means it is a link it is a link then we can able to specify and see whether it is work or not Now again, select the frame and I'll use for click link and I'm going to use the no frame and after that unselect the frame but select the frame we need to provide that name of the path. name and the value okay now we done for first we can able to click in the top one is this one b i d i and again b i d i it will click for second place and then it will click for no frames okay this is our main operation we are going to do it now okay now you can able to see this is Ten, and I'm going to hitting now it will do for one by one option and then it will click for one frame first frame and then it will jump into that first frame to out of the frame then again it will move to second frame it is very clicked again it is clicked and no frame means it will uh, move expanded Yes, it is failed. Yes, it is failed because no frame is not found in the link with the locators. Okay.
एंकर टेबल टू कॉपी द एक्सपर्ट we can able to copy the xpath and we can able to click click link click element xpath colon and we can able to provide the xpath of that we'll see if it is not click and we'll see another format to do that our main decision third frame it should be click it is moved into the third frame but it is not able to click for no frames one now it is clicked for no frames it is expanded right and it will wait 2 seconds and it will close the browser also oh we are not used for close browser that's why it is okay. but it is passed it is clicked for everything correct this is a way we can able to handle for frames i hope you understand this framework video and if you like this video please like my video please subscribe my youtube channel and don't forget to give the some comment if you give the comments then only i can give the more videos with the quality of content okay that's all about this video thank you